with new sight words. So as you, as they come up on the board, I want you to say them as loud as you can and be confident, okay, with what they are. Here we go. me. 
way, let me show everybody at home. Different is awesome because it's about a little boy that doesn't have part of his arm. He was born without his arm. Aww. And he's different. He's not the same as everybody else. But does that make him less special? No. no. Does that make him less important? No. Or less smart? No. Okay. All of us in this room are different from each other. Yep. Okay. All of us. Some are boys. Some are girls. We have so many differences. Tall, short. Dif different color eyes, different color hair, different color skin. We're all different. We like different things. Some of us are really good at sports. Others are really good at math. We all have different things about us, but we are all special. But different means we're just not the same as each other. And what a boring world it would be if we were all the same, right? Yeah. All right, the next one. What's this word? Trade. Trade. Very good. To give one thing away and get something else, okay? Um, my little boy, whoo, he loves to trade snacks with people. He would go to school with his lunch or his snack, and he would come home and say, Mama, I had a Swiss roll or whatever. I'm like, where did you get that? Oh, I traded. I gave up something I have to give to somebody else, and they give me something. So you're just swapping. Okay, everybody say trade. Trade. Good, nicely done. All right, the next one, what is this one? Stairs. Look at it again. Stairs. But is this the kind of stairs you climb? No. This is to look at something for a while with eyes wide open. So you have your eyes wide open and you're staring at something. Maybe you... Or, yeah, it could be. It, sometimes you get that look when you daydream. But if you're staring at something, um, maybe you think something's beautiful. Miss Bryant likes to stare at sunsets. When they're not so bright, you don't want to stare at the sun. That would be oh, too, too much. But yeah, to, you think you get blind. Yes, you might, you mm -hmm. might could. But I love to stare at sunsets because they're beautiful. I could stare at the face of my little boys all day long because I love them a lot. But you can also get the stairs. Have you ever had the stairs and somebody's calling your, your name and you're like, oh wait, sorry, I had the stairs. I wasn't paying attention. All right, next one, what is this one? Glance. glance. If you glance at something, you look quickly. I want everybody to glance at PJ. Don't stare, just glance. Glance at my necklace. Oh, but don't stare. You're just glancing. <laughs> Very good. So glance is you look quickly. You would have to do that to the big sun. You can't stare at the big sun. But you could glance at it real quick and get a quick look at it. Very nice. All right, let's do our phonics. What is a blend? What is a blend? A consonant blend is two or more consonants consecutive consonants whose sounds blend together, okay, whose sounds blend together. Let's look at some examples. Trips. Everybody say trips. 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 These two letters make separate sounds individually, okay? I could say t, er, ips, but I don't say t, er, ips. I'm going on the t, er, ip to the beach. You don't say that, do you? Yeah. You say tr, tr, tr. Everybody say tr, tr, tr. tr. And, and I shouldn't have put a uh at the end. Just go tr, tr, tr. No, that's too dramatic. Say tr, tr, tr. Very good. Trips. Everybody say trips. All right. What is this word? Grass. What consonant blend? What does this say? It say grr. Very good. Grr. You don't say, I'm going to cut the g. Or ass. You say grass. Everybody say grass. Yes. Very good. All right, what about this one? Crack. Very good. Say it again. Crack. All right, the CR makes a blended sound. Cr. All right, so we have um, those were blending with what letter? Oh. R. Okay, here's some that blend with the letter L. Are you ready? What's this word? Clap. Clap. Very good. What's this one? Plans. Plans. Everybody say plans. Plans. What's this one? Belt. Belt. So we have cl, pl, and then at the end, you, they can 
and even blend at the end, like LT, so belt, LT. All right, these blend with the letter S. S and what? S, K. S and K, so what does this say? Mask, okay, we are very familiar with that, aren't we? All right, what about this one? West, good. And the last one? Stack, very good, nicely done. All right, everybody up, you ready? Let me hear ya. Who is the sentence about? 
Her family. That's who the sentence is about. So everybody say subject. Subject. Who the sentence is about. Who the sentence is about. Now let's look back at our definition. It says who or what is the sentence about. Because if I said the building is on fire, who would the sentence be about? The building is not a who, it's a what. Okay? So if I said the building is on fire, then what is the subject of that sentence? The building, even though it's not a person. Very good. All right? Um, let, I want you to try it. I want you to raise your hand if you think you know the answer to the first one. Okay? Barry and Tia are friends. Barry and Tia are friends. Who would like to tell me who the subject is in that sentence? Good, Barry and Tia. I was so afraid you were going to just say Barry, but you're right. It's Barry and Tia. There's two people that, that that sentence is about, all right? The pizza is delicious. The pizza is delicious. Tell me. The pizza. Good, the pizza. That is what our sentence is about, the pizza. Very good. All right, this one's tricky. They're going to try to trick you. The whole class was in line. The whole class is in line. What do you think the subject is? The whole class. Woo! Good job. The whole class. I, was, I thought you might say the class. And it's not just the class. It's the whole class. Very good. Take your foot off for me, baby. All right. Y'all did great. So the subject's pretty easy, right? Thumbs up if you understand the subject. Thumbs down if you have no idea what I'm talking about. Okay, good. Thumbs up. Very good. All right. The predicate is what the subject does or what the subject is. Okay? You're confused. I see it all over your faces, so let's look at some examples. Okay? He reads every night. Okay? The subject is he. That's who the sentence is about. Now, what did the subject do? Reads every night. Very good. This is kind. This is the action. It's what the subject. Um, and let's go back. It's what the subject does or what the subject is. Okay. Grandma cooked spaghetti. The subject is what? Grandma. grandma. That's who the sentence is about. But what did grandma do? Cook spaghetti. Cook spaghetti. So the predicate is cooked spaghetti. Very good. All right, we drove to California. The subject is what? We, okay, we, and what did we do? Drove to California. And what are these called? Predicate. Say it again. Predicate. Very good. The predicate, this is just a little hint, a little bonus. You can say, thank you, Miss Bryant. The predicate always starts with a verb. Now, some of you are like, whoa. What is a verb? We haven't even talked about that yet. I know. So I'm going to tell me. That's a, first, a verb is something you do. A verb is something you do. A verb is something which you do. Um, Man, verb. those first grade verb. teachers are doing good down there at Clinton yeah. Park. Um, a verb is yeah. an action or a linking or helping verb, and we'll talk about that a little bit later. Okay? Now, let's try it. What is the predicate? The water felt ice cold. The water felt ice cold. Raise your hand if you want to tell me what the predicate is. The predicate is that you're telling somebody this. Okay, but in this sentence, what's the predicate? The water felt ice cold. The water. Okay, the water is the what, everybody? Subject. The subject. Very good. So what if the water is the subject, what's going to be the predicate? Felt, uh, felt ice cold. Felt ice cold. Very good. Felt ice cold. Jackson sung a solo. Jackson sung a solo. What's the predicate? He sung a solo. Sung a solo. Very good. So that makes the subject what? Jackson. 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 Good. They took a long lunch break. They took a long lunch break. What is the predicate? Eden, I mean, sorry. I'm trying not to say names. Eden, go. Uh, they took a long lunch break. Okay, but what's the predicate? They took a long lunch break. Okay, what's the predicate? They took a long lunch break. 
Take the subject off and tell me the rest. Took a long Good, very good. Took a long 